What's up guys, it's Kevin from K-Square Fitness and today we're breaking down our K2 run program and seeing if it's a good fit for you. What's up guys, we're gonna be breaking down the K2 run program and I wanna make sure that I'm steering you in the right direction. The run program that we have is not for a new beginner. This run program is pretty intense and this is for someone who's already been running but maybe wants to dial in and get a little more serious. They wanna know exactly what to do every single day. They wanna have percentages and pacings and all that stuff. Our K2 cardio might be a better option for you. It's still really effective 20, 30 minutes, but if you're newer, you might wanna go into that. If you want to step up your running, this may be the plan for you because throughout the calendar year, we're gonna have different run training cycles that are gonna focus on improving your mile time, improving your 5K, getting you used to longer distance runs. And we'll do that by doing our cycles. We'll have, let's say we did a test here Throughout the training cycle, we will, of course, follow our different programs three days a week. And we will execute these, you know, things like speed training, fartlek training, interval training, all very specific data. And then we will do this for a number of weeks, six, eight, 10 weeks, depending on how long the training cycle is. We will retest it and you are gonna see performance because this is the same exact training program that I've done with you know, special forces in the military, elite runners, and it's what's gotten a lot of results for people that have put in the work, and we do that by following this process here. A lot of runners, I find, don't spend enough time on mobility and lengthening their muscles. So, one, we'll focus on mobility every single day, five, 10 minutes. Here, warm up, I'm not talking about the generic run at half a mile and then get into your running. We're doing things like A skips, B skips, C skips, running mechanic drills, getting you to be a more efficient runner just by adding 10 minutes into your training routine and doing things like this on a weekly and daily basis, you're gonna be more efficient so that when you get into the actual run workout, you have better mechanics and you move better. Within each run workout, of course, it's gonna be different every single day. We'll be following this training cycle path you're gonna have mental mindset coaching notes so that as you're executing the workout, you know how to approach it and how to gradually get better. Just like as if I were running it, what I'd be telling myself in my head. A lot of people skip this component of training. You gotta train really hard and you gotta recover hard. So doing things like the recovery and the stretch component is something that's in the program that is also gonna help improve your performance. So make sure you do this. This is foam rolling helping your body to recover, tissue work, all that good stuff. And then stretching, this will help calm down your nervous system so that you can get into a restorative state. Don't skip it. If the K2 run program sounds like a good fit for you, check out casewarefitness.com and see how you can get started for just a dollar. And we'll see you on the other side.